is college football season, and if you know me, you know that I love college football, especially my beloved Sooners. And I had a major aha moment a couple of weeks ago when watching my team play about how often we compare ourselves to others and how we can stop with a really simple trick. Stay tuned. What's up, y'all? It is Dr. Allison, and I am a licensed clinical psychologist that is pretty much obsessed with breaking down and simplifying psychology to make it relatable and helpful for your everyday life. I know how often we compare ourselves to others. It is such a difficult trap. And I had an aha moment a couple of weeks ago when I was watching the highlights of my team's game on Saturday. So quickly, let me paint the picture. I had watched the game. Now, we pulled out a W, but it was not pretty, right? It was not a good game. We were not playing our best. Uh, it wasn't great. Lots of screaming and yelling on my part. But when I watched the highlights later, I was watching them on my phone, right, and they're just showing, you know, major play, touchdown, interception, all back to back. And I was looking at it and I was like, dang, we look awesome. And then I thought and I was like, wait a minute, I watched this game like four hours ago. We did not look awesome. Why, why all of a sudden am I like, oh my God, we looked amazing. And it hit me. When we watch a highlight reel, all we're seeing is the good stuff, the best, the little clips that are amazing. But when we see the raw, unedited, untouched, unfiltered version of the game, you see all the mess, right? You see all the things that don't go well. You see all the, the mistakes. And it made me think about how much we do that in our own lives. We only see the highlight reels of other people's lives, right? Either what we see on the outside, what they present on social media, or even what they tell us, right? We usually see only the good stuff with maybe a few flaws here and there. But with our stuff, y'all, we know all of our raw, unedited footage, right? You know the yucky stuff of your life, your insecurities, your fears, your mistakes, the time you totally have like foot and mouth moments, right? The, the times where you're really struggling, you know all of that. But you only know the highlight reel of other people's lives. It is normal to compare ourselves, and we all do that as humans. But I think it's so important to remind ourselves we're comparing apples to oranges. We're comparing a beautiful shortened highlight reel to raw, unedited, all-access pass information. And those two things are never going to look similar. As someone who has the privilege of listening to people's stuff and their raw, unedited footage every single day as part of my job, I can tell you with 100% certainty that everybody has their stuff, their baggage, their fears, their mistakes, their insecurities. We all have it. I think it's so easy for us to look at other people and say like, mm, Allison, not really, or like sort of, but it's not as bad as mine. You are looking at their highlight reel, not the raw, unedited footage. And I'm telling you, you're comparing things that will never be the same. So when you find yourself comparing yourself to someone else or looking at someone, whether it's on social media or even a good friend that you have, you're looking at their relationships, you're looking at their job, you're looking at their personality, you're looking at the way they parent, you're looking at how much money they have, whatever. When you find yourself doing that, I want you to stop and remind yourself that you are only seeing their highlight reel doesn't mean they're trying to be shady. It just means that's part of being a human is we can't know somebody else's raw, unedited footage. So when you see that, I want you to remind yourself, this is their highlight reel. I am comparing my raw, unedited footage to their highlight reel. It's not fair, it's not helpful, and it's not accurate. So my challenge to you is this. When you find yourself comparing your stuff or yourself to somebody else and their stuff, I want you to stop. And I want you to say, I am comparing my raw, unedited footage to this person's highlight reel. And those two things will never look the same and will never match up. 
That's my challenge to y'all. Thank you so much for spending your time today with me. I'm so grateful that you continue to come back and check out my stuff. If you want more stuff like this about how you can live a meaningful and healthy life, definitely go check out my website, DrAllisonAnswers.com. If you're watching this on YouTube, definitely hit subscribe because then you'll be updated on videos as they come out. And of course, you can also find me on Facebook. I post a lot throughout the week sending little tidbits that might help you out. Highlight reels, y'all, they're awesome and they look so good but they are rarely representative of what's really going on. Don't forget that. Take care.